We're gonna start filming their Insta stories. Welcome to Days and Nights UCF's Insta Scoop. We are gonna go to, I think, all night study. I don't know, it just like looks really modern. It's actually really good. Good morning guys, it is October 20th and I'm starting a weekend in my life today. I don't really have that much to do this weekend, not really sure what's gonna go on, so I'm kind of winging it, but today I am filming for UCF for their Instagram stories and I wanted to take you guys along because I think that would be really cool and also cool for me to like have for memories and stuff like that. So I hope it goes well. Um, I'm supposed to be meeting them at the marketing offices at 2.30 and it's currently 12.37. So I kind of wanted to film like a little Instagram video. I don't know how it's going to work out because the background's like really wrinkly even though I put it in the dryer for like an hour. Um, and it has like random stains like that one. I don't know where that came from. But yeah, this is my first like Instagram beauty video. I don't know how it's gonna go. So I don't know if I'm really gonna post it or not. Um, but I just might as well because I was gonna do it with like the Fenty foundation right here. And I just did a tutorial. So it could be like just like pushing out that video. So I just got done with my Instagram video. So this is my finished look with the Fenty foundation. I personally really like it. Like it's not as full coverage as a MAC Studio Fix, which I'm obsessed with because it's just so full glam. And I like like that when I'm trying to do my makeup, like when it's an everyday makeup thing, I just like do my Makeup Forever HD stick. But like when I'm trying to go full glam, I want it to be super full coverage. So that's why I like the Studio Fix. But the Fenty foundation, you have to apply like two layers um so it just adds a little bit more time which isn't like too crazy right now i'm going to go drive to the marketing offices at ucf and we're going to start filming their insta stories and it's not going to be like just like on a phone like regular instagram stories it's going to be like those high tech like super cool like after effects type things so we're going to pre-film everything today and then like it's going to go out like next wednesday i think so so hopefully i can get like the file and like kind of like overlay it on this video because i want to have it and save it for my memories and maybe even like a demo reel for the future i don't know <laughs> kind of off topic but i have been eating really really healthy for five days now and i've gone to the gym four days like not today because i was filming and stuff and i don't want to go later because like mm, i don't want to waste my makeup and i think i need to film another video but anyways, I have been eating really good and working out and like honestly, I woke up with the best morning body ever. It just gives me a lot more encouragement and like telling me to like keep going because obviously I want to look super good for my 21st birthday, which is in like almost a month, which is literally insane to me. Like how am I getting this old? Like I don't even know. But I really want to look really cute and really hot and take really cute Instagram. So I just need to look good for that and just for myself in general. And I feel like college is like the best time to look your best, if that makes sense. Like older people, you know how they say like, oh, I wish I had my college bod back. Well, I feel like I'm going to end up like liking my out of college bod better than my college bod because I feel like I'll have more time to like go to the gym and eat healthy because obviously in KD and in the sorority house, like, there's meal plan and it's really hard to like, I'm sorry about the sun, it's like going in and out, but it's really hard to just say no to things. Like there has been so much dessert because daggerman season is upon us. And if you guys don't know what that is, it's just like picking our sweetheart. And so they just bring like treats to the house every single day. Our house mom is amazing. She puts like Halloween candy out everywhere. So it's really, really hard to like pass the corners and like not take a Milky Way because are my fave but i have been doing really good there has been like some healthier options like tuna stuff and then like some salads and obviously we have like a salad bar at, like lunch and dinner every day so that's a little bit easier but i just went grocery shopping yesterday and i just got like a few things for the weekend so it is 209 right now so i'm going to go ahead and head out really quickly i just wanted to show you guys my outfit of the day before i left this is from plato's closet so i really don't know where it's from um, but it is beautiful and I'm so glad I found it. It's like so nicely beaded over here and then it has these fun little tassels 
Then I have my American Eagle jeans, which I like cut up on the knees. And then I have my key sunglasses that are super scratched up and that I need to get a new pair, but I don't have anything else. So that's what we're gonna use today. Then we got my Apple Watch and everyone always asks me where I got this band. It's from Amazon for like $35 and I had to get it fitted for like five, but like so worth it, so worth it. And my earrings are from Boohoo. It's like these drop down diamond shaped earrings that are gold. Um, but yeah, that's my outfit. I never leave the house without it. Yeah, this is a microphone. My name is Brendan Brown, <laughs> and I go to the University of Central Florida with the Sonali as well. <laughs> We're here at UCF. Um, yeah, I work out and enjoy working out and eating. And what do you do here, Brandon? Um, I interned for the University of Central Florida's marketing um, department mm. to help create stuff for Instagram, um, social media in general, Mm -hmm. and hopefully run their social media ambassadors program. My name is Nicole Dudenhofer. I'm a student here at UCF. Um, I'm a journalism major. I work in UCF marketing as an intern for Pegasus. With them, I write, I edit, I get photos, I help out with managing edited documents, all the different types of stuff. Super cool. And then this is Carly. She's been in my vlogs before, but you can, <laughs> you can introduce yourself again just I'm to Carly. recap. I'm Carly. I'm the social media coordinator for UCF. So I tweet and I Facebook. Instagram and a video and photo. <laughs> Do it design. all. Yeah, university. <laughs> and there's their cool office. All these super cool posters everywhere. So we just got to the stadium. We're gonna film here. Is that new? This thing? Uh, yeah. This oh, year. that's the cabanas, right? Mm -hmm. I think that's the lounge. Oh. Um, Or should we do it? Um, yeah. It'd be cool to get some. I don't know if I want more of this or more of this, like the, the box. <laughs> UCF Not continues a... its winning streak after. Oh. Oh, yeah. You can't go that far, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, you're rolling, okay. so. Okay. Welcome to Days and Nights. UCF's InstaScoop. I'm your host, Sonali. Let's talk about some cool things happening on campus. Welcome to Days and Nights UCF's InstaScoop. I'm your host, Sonali. Let's talk about some cool events happening on campus. So we just got done filming, and I think I did pretty well. Like, at first, I was pretty nervous because I didn't know exactly what I was going to say, and I'm not too good with, like, on-the-spot things, um, but... We kind of like made a little script before so I could just like practice it on the way to like locations, try to block the sun. But I'm so excited to see how this Instagram story is going to turn out. And I will hopefully post it in this video because if you missed it, then I feel like there's no way else to see it, you know, if I don't post it. So hopefully they'll send it to me and I can post it in this video. Welcome to Days and Nights UCF's InstaScoop. I'm your host, Sonali. Let's talk about some cool events happening on campus. Almost 26 years ago, at the time was right for me to become UCF's fourth president. Today, the time is right uh, for me to leave the presidency. Since 1992, Martha and I have been honored to work alongside many exceptional people. Being at UCF has been one of the greatest joys of our lives. Thank you to everyone who's made our remarkable university what it is today. Martha and I are forever grateful for your support. Thank you. Tomorrow is the Fright Night event at 8 p.m. The Haunted Trail starts here at Lake Clare and ends at Towers 1 and 2. Join Cab and Late Nights for a night of scares and fun. And after you complete the trail, join us for a spooky celebration. This Friday is also the last day of registration for the Student Union's 5th Annual Pumpkin Palooza event. This event will last from 11 to 2 p.m. You can sign up with a team of 2 to 5 people to carve your own pumpkin masterpiece, and there will be 3 winners. Only 20 teams can register, but don't worry, there will be many more activities to participate in.
Are you carving your own UCF-themed pumpkin? Post it on social media with the hashtag UCF Pumpkin for your chance to win a UCF prize pack. Halloween is right around the corner, so have fun dressing up in your scariest outfits and make sure to stay safe. Don't forget to come out and cheer on your nights this Saturday at 5 p.m. as they take on Austin P. Thanks for watching Days and Nights UCF's Insta Scoop. If you guys want to know more about what's happening around campus, make sure to swipe up on this Instagram story to download our UCF mobile app. And don't forget to share this story with your friends. I'm Sonali, and we'll see you guys on our next Insta Scoop. Welcome to Days and Nights UCF's Insta Scoop. I'm your host, Sonali, and let's talk about what's happening around campus. Pop Parlor recently introduced a Blueberry Lemonade Limitless Obstacle. 15% of the proceeds from each purchase goes to benefit Limitless Solutions, a nonprofit organization that creates affordable 3D printed bionic arms for kids in need. Founded by a UCF alumnus, the organization combines engineering, design, and art to build fully functional prosthetic limbs. Swipe up to see some of the recipients and to learn more about their stories. Grab a blanket and relax on Memory Mall for Career Services Handshake Movie Night. Starting at 5 p.m., they will be showing the intern on November 9th. Popcorn and smoothies will be provided, so don't miss out. I have a business degree, but I never seem to do anything right around here. After a terrific season last year with 24 wins, UCF's basketball team takes on Mercer Bears for the first game of the season. Come out Friday, November 10th at 8 p.m. and help kick off our next great season. If you have a business idea or are looking to create one, the Blackstone Launchpad located in the Student Union is a free resource that provides professional coaching to help you develop your concept. Swipe up for more information. If you're looking for some adrenaline-filled fun, check out the Open Night Climb on Wednesday, November 15th at 7 p.m. This free event will give you the chance to complete the high ropes course near Central Florida Boulevard. Only the first 120 students will be able to climb, so make sure to get there early. Honor those who have served our country on Saturday, November 11th for Veterans Day. In observance of the holiday, campus will be closed November 10th. Classes and other activities will resume on Monday, November 13th. Thanks for watching Days and Nights UCF's Insta Scoop. To find out more, swipe up to download the UCF mobile app. And don't forget to share this story with your friends. I'm your host, Sonali, and we'll see you guys next time. So I'm definitely not wasting my makeup today. I filmed one Instagram video so far, and I'm gonna film a video for me right now for my channel, and I filmed the UCF things. So I'm very glad that this makeup is making like an appearance in all these videos, because then I don't have to do it that many times like throughout the week. But I am gonna be filming a college hacks video right now. It should be up by the time this vlog is up. This is a setup for right now, and I wanna try a different like format. So I think I'm gonna like stand up and just talk, cause it's like a talking video, but I feel like more hyped if I'm standing, if that makes sense, so. Hopefully you guys like it. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. So I just got done filming my video, which I'm really excited about because I was about to get in bed and like take my makeup off for the day because I was feeling lazy, but I'm glad I pushed through and filmed a video and hopefully I can get this video up within the next two days. Good morning guys. Happy October 21st and it is currently like 2, 2.30. 2 yeah. And we are gonna go to, I think, all night study to just get stuff done. So I have a lot of videos to edit and just like a lot of homework. And I wanna get it all done by tomorrow. So I can have like a nice, chill, relaxing Sunday. They're currently getting some coffee. Peppermint mocha creamer. Why? Why are you saying it's good? Because it's peppermint. Yeah, it's good. Like peppermint. You gotta focus it with the hand. <laughs> it's too big. I know. <laughs> so we made it to all night study and this place is really really cool. They have like super cool like chairs everywhere. I don't know, it just like looks really modern. Oh. <laughs> like look how cool these chairs are and we're in like this little booth thing. Yeah. So we are back in my room. And I'm gonna try this seaweed salad that I got from Publix the other day. It was five dollars, which honestly is a lot for just like this. There's like, personally, there's nothing in it. I don't know. 
we'll see. It smells good. Mm. It's actually really good. I like it. <laughs> Good morning guys, it is Sunday and it is the seventh day of my diet and I just checked my weight and I've lost three pounds already, which is good, but you know, a little slow because um, like in the summer I did like the no carb diet and like on the low carb diet, you lose like weight super fast. So I'm just like used to that, um, but you know, trying to do it like a little healthier way. I'm going to the gym too. I'm like working out with it too and usually I like don't work out when I diet which is like also bad um but I'm gonna go to the gym I'm gonna go to Knights Plaza gym because it's a little closer and every time I like don't have anyone to go to the gym with I like to walk to a closer distance if that makes sense um but it is currently almost 12 but it's currently almost 12 so when I come back I'm gonna shower and get my day started I'm not really sure if there's like a lot going on today so I'll probably end the vlog sooner Oh, 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 oh,